Ray wants to set it on fire. <laughs> Morning. I think it's uh, three pigs in a blanket and a dozen assortment donut holes. Is that all? That's it, boy. Did you want anything? Okay. You look wide awake. I look bad. Sorry for the camera angle. This is what you get when you got one arm. You're welcome. Hey, toast. To stand up till 3 a.m. Mm -hmm. So this is what Case gets for breakfast. No, wow. A dozen assorted donuts. That was a low blow. Donut holes. More donut holes. Morning everybody. Chad and their farms. First thing we gotta do is run to TSC. And working with one arm. In case you've been living under a rock. Boy, this camera, this it just it doesn't work. Working with one arm is kind of like working with Case. So I brought my right arm. See what I did? I brought it back around. And we're going to go measure where the highlands are going. Now, how soon will they be out here? I don't know. But I gotta do something. Tuesday, the day after surgery, I felt really good. And Ray tried to tell me that's because I still had anesthesia in my system. And she was right, because yesterday was Wednesday and I don't say this word very much, but yesterday sucked. <laughs> yesterday was not fun. Like I mentioned, it's just a bicep. There's people with real ailments, and some of you all are even that way. You've got chronic pain and things like that, so I don't I don't mean to be whatever. I did not listen to Ray, and yesterday was pretty stinking rough. I didn't move from the lazy boy all day, except to get anesthesia out of my system, if you know what I mean. Today I'm feeling a lot better. I quit taking my pain meds. I'm just not a big pain medicine person. It doesn't hurt, it really doesn't. I mean, as long as I don't jiggle my arm or wiggle my fingers funny, it doesn't hurt. So don't do that, right? Mm -hmm. So I, get, I ain't doing the pain meds anymore. So anyway, I'm gonna run in here and get some markers. So when we measure things, we can mark it. All right, what do you say, BRB, mm -hmm. burb? Okay, burb. A six minute drive. Or cool. this has to open the gate. We do it. Thanks, man. Mm -hmm. You got your lunch or your breakfast? Mm -hmm. Morning, sunshine. Morning. I love you, man. Love you too. Thanks for helping me. Mm -hmm. Pay you an Xbox gift cards later. No, you won't. Yeah, I will. All Be right. Bet. <laughs> Will you grab the bucket and the flag markers out of there? They're in the, where Bub sits. <laughs> What's going on guys? Well, it's gonna rain, but I'd rather do this in the shade, especially while I'm injured. I'm on the mend, I'm not injured now. We just got a little tiny project today. Well, a little tiny, cause I don't have to do it, Case does. Right here is like a five acre, I call it the hay pasture, cause they used to hay this and this alone. And what we want to do is measure this off. See that gate? That's where the Burger Bros are, right? We want to come off of there about almost as far as we can, but certainly to like maybe just this side of that tree, this side of it. You guys can't tell. My camera angles are way off. You want to feed some alpacas first or? Not really. What? You said they spit on you yesterday. I don't want to get closer than oh, Man, I forgot we told you that. <laughs> I got some markers too. 
Look, look. It's your favorite color. You better hurry because they're going to come running. Well, they don't spit until you give them the grain. Just open it up. Get the grain. You better hurry. Tina's a spitter. Tina. Lady A. How's the cud? Alan. What's up, buddy? Walk over there. Tina, back up. Back up. Back up. What are you walking that way for? He don't like you guys. He don't. Hmm. All right, you gotta shake it so they come over here. Put, stay put. Shake it like I was. Come on now, Packers. Come on, Sid. Okay, go put it in there. They're gonna jump you. Get out of the way. <laughs> you still got the magic bucket. Case. <laughs> They're still looking for you. He pees funny. You pee funny. I don't. Based on what's on the back of the lid, you pee funny. No, I don't. That's Carter. <laughs> Alan, your food's in the trough, man. It's over there, bro. Tina, be nice. Unless you're guarding. Lady A, just do Lady A things. So I think we should build you a tiny home. Put a fence around it. And put a guard alpaca in the fence. No. Uh huh. No. <laughs> I definitely should have put a sling on this pew pew. Come on, here. Case wants to fish a little bit. What do you got? Just a swim bait? Yeah. No worms and bobbers. He's too cool for that now. Watch for snakes or thorns. <laughs> they won't come out till it's hotter. I mean, they're out, but not today. And thankfully, what we have noticed is we just have a whole lot of water snakes. Nothing crazy poisonous. All right, if you want to catch a bass, I'm already learning this pond. It's awesome. If you want to catch a bass with that lure, you know, stand down here on the point. And you guys keep saying that we have possibly a muskrat and not a beaver because you don't see any dams. The dams are on the other side of the bank, the other side of our dam. I'm pretty confident it's a beaver. Could be both, who knows. You wanna stand right here and throw just to that tree that's in the water right there. Throw along the bank, don't throw in the tree. So see that log coming out of the water? Throw to the right of that. See that tall grass? Just try it. There you go. Look at that guy. <laughs> Pull him on the bank, you're gonna lose him. Look at that fish, man. I him on accident. No, don't tell people that. Well, I did. Oh. That is a huge fish. Look at that guy. Bass, man. I didn't even mean to. Okay. And you don't ever, some people will like, I don't want to do it, but they'll like rock their hand and hold the fish up. Like, don't do that. It's going to do support their belly like that. That is a big old fish. Is that as long as daddy's arm? Basically. Yeah. Woo! Sorry you didn't get to eat anything, buddy. Don't touch it. Okay. Slimy. Feel this feel this where my where my thumb is. It's just sandpaper. Yeah, it is a little gritty. 
Look at you, man. I would say that is the biggest bass in the pond so far. Yeah. Caught him on a little Walmart swim jig. I didn't mean to. You didn't mean to? No, no you always tell people you meant to, man. <laughs> All right, since he's been out of the water for a minute, because we've been taking pictures, come over here and just lay him down real slow. Let him swim off. Don't drop him in. Lay him in the grass? Yep, squat down. Just lay him in there. Put his head in the water, honey. There you go. That's a huge fish, man. Huh? Yes, you did. That was awesome. Good job. And somebody got the concrete truck running over there this morning. It's not us, unfortunately. You want real ducks? Yeah. Like quackers? You're silly. I know. Well, we had a grebe out here. A grebe ain't quite the same as a duck. And it eats all your fish, but I think he migrated. So we got a little sidetracked. We did come out to uh, mark where we want the highlands. If we did that today, they won't be out here any quicker. So I'm in no shape, no position to chase highlands if they get out or get squirrely or whatever. But it is something that needs to be done. So we were just, I don't know, finding something to do. But then we get out here and even though it's a little breezy, there's a storm blowing in, it's really pretty. But it's not as breezy as it was the other day. And Case caught that one fish, which is the only one we've caught, but that's how determined he is. And I figured I'd give the old uh, bread ball a try. And since we had these donuts, I don't know if they like donuts or not, but we'll see. We haven't seen any signs of catfish, zero. So I don't know if there's catfish out here or not, but we'll keep trying. Let me know down in the comments, somebody said something about carp grass carp that don't reproduce which would be awesome is that is that real is that fake does that actually exist i know i can google it i know i can get on the interweb but some of you guys that have actually stocked ponds and manage your own ponds for years will know but we do have a lot of grass and it's just going to get thicker and thicker so i'd like to get a couple of carp in here clean some of it up but just let us know or what's best to clean this grass up Aside from draining it and starting over, I don't think that's, we're not there. We've got a good, healthy pond full of life. We're not draining it. Did you aim at the turtle or the donut? I thought I aimed at the turtle, but I think I hit the donut instead. We're trying to get rid of the turtles. I know, but the donuts in more pieces, so there's more turtles now. Well, not shooting, Alice. He got a donut and swam away. No, I didn't. He ain't floating. I really want to know if we have catfish. That's what I want to know. Well, surely there is. Like, who built a pond and just put the bass in? Bass aren't even, they're a lot of fun to fish, but I don't want to, I don't like eating them. Bluegill's good, catfish is good, crappie's good, walleye, trout, bass. There's so many other fish on the food chain. I'd rather eat a turtle. So if this seems cruel to some of you guys, just understand that we have a turtle problem. They also get a really good luck. Yeah. <laughs> They said they also get a really good last meal. It's a donut. But we literally are catching fish and turtles are chasing them in on the line. That's how many turtles we have. So we've got to get rid of some of these turtles. They've just gone unmanaged for six or seven years and they're all probably what? Six, seven, eight inches around? Yeah, they're pretty big. Yeah, they're not they're not little turtles. And they can't thrive here. Like they're they're competing for food. So we've got to get some of them out of here. I don't mind a few, but it's pretty bad. We won't show it or anything like that. Yeah, be quicker, Nancy. 
I'm walking down here because if you stand up, they go back under. So that's why Case is sitting down now in that bucket. But, yep. I gotta get some carp out here. Probably should either brush hog this again or I need to get my dad out here <clears throat> with his weed eater and have him cut all this down. So, cause like, even if I had a zero turn, which I'm in talks with two companies on zero turns, and I think one of them's gonna work out. One of them is gonna work out. I just don't know which one yet. But even if I had a zero turn, I can't cut, see the bank where Case is sitting? I can't cut that with my zero turn. So, not yet anyway. It's gotta be, uh, needs to be managed a little bit and get these thorns out of here. And I think this is that multi-flora rose stuff. Let me, let me use my app real quick. It is starting to rain a little bit. Case does not have rain gear on. Right. He's a goober. There's a black jacket in my truck that's rain gear. It's starting to rain in harder. Yeah. We got Case a raincoat. This or, is nice. It's not bad. Ray wants to set it on fire. <laughs> It's a rat. Yeah. You're so big. Woo. That's all right. When they can't hurt us, but... No, they can't hurt us, but... Jeez. Oh, I mean, I think I left my bicep on the ground when I stood up. <laughs> Whew, it scared me. Notice how I didn't even say anything. I just got up and moved and let you sit there. Yeah, you were <laughs> you're just like, oh, crap, that's scared. Oh, oh hey, Case, you should move. Whew. This is a pretty sweet little place to get out of the weather it's wide open on the side the storms come in on so we like it's almost like we just need to s switch the plywood but <laughs> don't do that to me right now <laughs> we left the donuts in the rain <laughs> but we got the rifle uh... it's all weather rifle it's good Let's see if the alpacas are using their uh shelter the two ladies are but they won't let alan in All right, right before we started getting poured on, I took a picture of these thorns. And this stuff is, boy, the trucks are ripping this morning. We've had a lot more traffic over on the road over there. I don't know if there's like trucks running gravel somewhere or what. But that's what the noise is. But anyway, that's called common ash thorn. Yeah, I don't know, I'll put a, I may have just butchered that, but I'll put a link right here. Or a picture. But anyway, we're back out of hiding. And we've kind of given up on getting the Highlands pasture situated this morning, but still plenty of daylight left. No, we'll probably still, hey, I got a fish. Come here, come here, come here. There's a stick fish. No, I think you have a turtle. Oh, legendary. You definitely had something, because I didn't set the, uh... it's gonna start raining again, God, yeah. Look. Hmm? If you guys pay attention, the water droplets will kind of pick up. You click the reel, right? So, yeah. So it's engaged. Yeah. And then you set the hook. See that? Set on. You're like, I think I, I think I go. I think I go. I think, oh no, he's gone. It's a he's turtle. Gone. It didn't matter. It's a turtle. All right, you film now. You're better. We'll run and hide again if the uh, weather picks up. But this isn't too bad if you have rain gear on. Cause it's like, what's the temperature? It's 64 degrees. It's actually really, it's actually really nice outside. It's very nice. But can you guys see my line? See it? See how it's uh, it's crooked and loose. A second ago, it was taut, going under and leaving the spool. So we had something. Yeah, that's it. Just watch that bread ball in front of you for turtles. Oh, Here, trade me. Two down inside him. Good, healthy. Cool. Nice. I like it. Hey, set the hook and reel that in. Wow. 
That is pretty handy though. We just put that on there yesterday. Actually, I know I put it on there Tuesday, didn't I? And then I got in trouble because I sent a picture to Ray and she was like, what are you doing out of bed? And I was like, nothing. That wasn't even that hard. I know, tell me about it. Yeah, listen, I don't need to, I don't need help getting in trouble. Okay. Hey, can we show them the mailbox? They said our mailbox looks little. So somebody asked us too, like, are we worried about people just driving around the gate? Not really. Because there were, there were some signs up here and some posts. And I also left barbed wire laying there. And I know where the barbed wire is at. Nobody else does. So if anybody does drive around the gate, it's not going to be fun. But the mailbox is actually huge. It's just got a 10 inch post underneath it. But stick your head in that mailbox, Sean. Okay, I... But, uh... but it's a huge mailbox. It's a package mailbox. It's 13 inches wide. I'll link it down below. 13 inches wide by probably 13 long. I don't know. Anyway, it is a package mailbox. So gonna get like a parcel box as well for like bigger packages like UPS USPS places for people to drop all of Ray's Amazon Prime deliveries off so because those are the most important but anyway we didn't do anything we set out to do today we set out to fish we didn't set out to fish we just ended up fishing we were like, let's fish too. So that technically counts. Yeah. Well, I mean, I don't care if we didn't get anything done, but we ended up fishing. That's good. Yeah. So, but now we're going to go home and edit. You guys are watching this the same day we filmed it. How about that? Thanks for all the thoughts and prayers. Still on the mend. Very little pain. Just some time. Time and healing. It's my favorite thing is being patient. So, anyway. Hey, if you guys want Case to film some stuff and maybe put some things on his little channel... Let me know. He started a streaming channel way back in the day. Did. I streamed a couple times and then I didn't use it. Well, in YouTube also, you had to be 13. Mm -hmm. So we had to wait. Well, now he's 13. I mean, he turned 13 in January. But now he can actually come out here and film maybe some behind the scenes stuff and upload it and they can watch it just yeah. for something to do. I could do that. Because didn't you say you wanted to do a true catch, clean, and cook on a yeah. fish? Yeah. So that's what we need to do. Mm -hmm. So do we tell him about your channel down below? Sure. Okay. There's a link to Case's channel down below. You're gonna have to upload now. I know. Pressure's on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Y'all be good. Don't work too hard. Don't make it weird. God bless. Deuces. Deuces. Why'd you do that? I don't know. It hurts. I don't know. See you guys.